first graders. Good morning. How are you? I hope all of you are healthy. Welcome back to our science lesson today. Well, kids, we are going to continue our Unit 6 plants. Lesson 3. Plants grow in different places. Plants are living things. So, in today's lesson, you are going to know that plants grow in different places. Kalian akan tahu bahwa tumbuh-tumbuhan atau tanaman tumbuh di tempat-tempat yang berbeda. You will also know that plants are living things that need air, food, and water to stay alive. Kalian akan mengetahui bahwa tanaman atau tumbuhan adalah benda hidup yang membutuhkan udara, makanan, dan juga air untuk tetap hidup. And the last, you will understand that plants respond to change, move, grow and change, have young and die. Kalian akan mengerti bahwa tanaman bisa merespon perubahan, tumbuh dan berubah, dan juga bisa mempunyai anak dan mati. Well kids, what do you think? Where do plants grow? Di mana tanaman tumbuh? Plants grow in different places. Tanaman tumbuh di tempat-tempat yang berbeda. Look at these pictures. In here, you can see that some plants grow on land. Beberapa tanaman tumbuh di tanah atau di daratan ya. Look at these kinds of plants. Next, if you see these pictures, these plants grow on water. Mereka tumbuh di atas air. Ada bunga teratai, ada enceng gondok, dan juga ada semanggi. Means, this plant only can grow on water. Because... They need much water to stay alive. What about this? Do you know this kind of plants? These plants grow on other plants. Tanaman ini hidup dan tumbuh di tanaman lain. Nah, di sini kalian bisa lihat bahwa beberapa tanaman tumbuh di batang pohon lainnya. Let's complete activity 6.3. Now, I want you to open your science activity book, page 42 and 43. Are you ready? Let's start it. Look at this. Which plants grow on land? Circle in green. Tanaman yang tumbuh di atas daratan Lingkari dengan warna hijau. Which plants grow on water? Circle in blue. Tanaman yang tumbuh di atas air, lingkari dengan warna biru. Which plants grow on the other plants? Circle in red. Tanaman yang tumbuh di atas tanaman lain atau di batang tanaman lain, lingkari dengan warna merah. So, let's do with the first picture. What do you think? Yes, it's on land. So, we circle it with green circle. What about the next picture? Yes, it grows on other plants. So, we circle it in red. Good. What about the third plant? 
Ya, yeah, it grow on land. So we circle it in a green. And what about the fourth picture? Ya, yeah, it grows on water. So we circle it in blue. Great job. Now, look at this one. What about the first picture? Yes, it grow on land. So we circle it in green. What about the next picture? Great, it grows on water. So we circle it in blue. What about the third picture? Yes, they grow on water. So we circle it in blue. And the last? Yeah, it grows on other plants. We circle it in red. Great job. Now, are plants living things? Apakah tanaman merupakan makhluk hidup? How do you know? Bagaimana kalian tahu? Let's check it out. Plants are living things. Jadi tanaman adalah makhluk hidup. Plants need air, food, and water. Tanaman membutuhkan udara, makanan, dan juga air. Just same like us. Sama seperti kita. In order to stay alive, we need air, food, and water. Next, plants make food from sunlight. Tanaman membuat makanan dari sinar matahari. Nah, ini melalui proses fotosintesis. Nanti kalian akan belajar lebih lanjut ketika kalian sudah kelas atas ya. Jadi, tanaman membutuhkan bantuan sinar matahari untuk membuat makanan. So, sunlight is very important for plants to make a food. Let's see this picture. Plants can have young. Tanaman juga mempunyai anak loh. Jadi kalau kalian lihat ada tanaman kecil, kemudian dia mempunyai tunas, dia juga uh, ada tumbuh tanaman-tanaman baru, ya. Nah itu namanya anak-anak dari tanaman tersebut, ya. Just same like us, like a human, like uh, animal, they also have young. Mereka juga mempunyai anak. The plants also can grow and change. Tanaman juga bisa berubah dan juga tumbuh. Ya, jadi dari kecil, kemudian besar, tinggi lagi, lalu tinggi lagi, lalu di sini bisa muncul lagi, mulai mulai muncul daun-daunnya, dan kemudian daunnya berkembang menjadi lebih banyak, dan akhirnya nanti akan tumbuh menjadi tanaman yang tinggi dan besar. Seperti itulah tanaman, just like a human also, like animal also, they can grow and change. And the last, plants can die. Tanaman bisa juga mati loh. Okay, if you see this picture, what happened with this picture? Why can it die? Kenapa bisa mati? Yes, because they also need water. They need food. They need sunlight. If they don't get it enough, they can die. Kalau mereka tidak cukup dengan makanan, udara, dan juga air, mereka bisa mati. That's why they are called as living things. Okay kids, for your assignment today, please complete exercise in science activity book page 44 until 45. Thank you so much for today's learning. See you next time in the next lesson. Bye, kids!